Department of Justice or DOJ spokesman Assistant Secretary Miko Clavado explained the cancellation of former Negros Oriental 3rd District Representative Arnolfo Arnitevez Jr.'s passport would result in a smaller world for him from the hands of justice. The cancellation bars his right to travel, especially to the other different countries. Hindi na siya makapaglipat ng bansa pa. Um, this is a very good development for us dahil yun naman talaga ang gusto natin na um, siguro to come back home and to face the charges like a man. Hence, the DOJ will allegedly oppose any attempt to reverse the Manila Regional Trial Court's decision to cancel Tevez's passport. Kung umabot man sa Supreme Court, ay uh, i-oppose talaga namin dahil sa tingin ko namin, um, this is something that uh, we will not let up on. No? Itong kaso na to ay nagpapakita ng impunity sa ating bansa. The cancellation would be final and executory after 15 days since the court released its order last February 8. The DOJ stands on its ground that Tevez Jr. is accountable to the Filipino over the gruesome Pamplona massacre. Matagal na namin hinihintay itong decision na to. Noong November pa kasi namin final yung motion to cancel the passport of former Congressman Arnulfo Tevez. Recently, Attorney Ferdinand Topacio, lawyer for Tevez Jr., said there are still legal remedies available for them and they will resort or utilize all of them. However, Clavano emphasized that the former Solon should be brought in court to face the murder charges against him over the demise of former Governor Ruel Digamo and several civilians. Dante Amento, UNTV News and Rescue. We serve the people. We give glory to God.